Hi, it's Colin, Head of Education here at Crocodiles of the World. Today talking, or having a look at crocodile ears. Um, now, crocodiles are water's edge, water's surface predators, so their main senses are on the top of their head, and that includes the ear. Where is it? A lot of people ask us, do they have ears? Yes, indeed. Just behind the eye, you'll see this little slit, uh, and that's where the ear is located. Beneath that little slit, that's the ear flap. If we were to lift that uh, flap, we would see the eardrum uh, just below that. Now, crocodiles do rely on hearing. You think about crocodile habitat, uh, swampy marshlands, things like like that uh, they rely on a lot of audible cues all right uh, so they call to each other they they're very very vocal so we know that hearing plays an important role uh, in their behavior and communication with each other um, so their hearing is very very good it's not as quite a broader range of hearing as the uh, human ear they can't hear some of the higher pitch sounds that we would be able to hear but at the same time they respond to some of the deeper frequencies that are below the level of human hearing hearing. So the inner ear of crocodilians, the eustachian system, uh, which is by the way a lot more similar to birds than it is in other reptiles and mammals, um, these tubes and canals help them uh, to directionalize sound. They, that's helped them to determine which direction the sound is coming from. It also helps them maintain equilibrium and a whole bunch of other little things from navigation, whether it's involved in how they can home. If we move, translocate a crocodile, it will find its way back home. The inner ear is partly involved in that, most likely. More research needed on that one. So there's a whole bunch of things going on, inside, going on inside the crocodilian ear that we're still trying to work out. It's a very, very complicated system of, uh, of canals and uh, linked passages within there. Really, really exciting for future research.